It doesn't matter, Fitball. It doesn't matter. I'm always going to be on the band. Little Richie Cappy is back home in New York. Little Richie will always have a bass antenna right up here in Crown Heights. And according to my family, if need be, they told me look around Brooklyn Heights. They said there's a couple of good spots I might like up there. We got a lot of properties up there. So, you know, either way, Mr. Fitball. Either way, Whitey Old Control will live up to its long 30 year, 3 decade, 10, 11, 9 year repertoire. <laughs> <laughs> this cat gotta be related to Big Man of Harbor Master. He laughs like a weak pussy jackass with no balls. Who 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 got him to take it down? Who got him to take it down? I'm sorry, we stepped on you. Well, all we heard was got him to take it down and soon come. That's all the video gate got. That's all Brooklyn got. That's all DX land got. And I'm back wide. Got kind of hurt. Mwah. Sounds like you're crying. Brown shoes, my apologies deeply, my man. No, sir, because Pitbull Gate doesn't have half the balls, half the manhood, or half the radio. Me, I'm a radio operator. I'm a CB shop runner and a technician. And I'll say it again. I do apologize for Brown Shoes for defending myself unwarranted and unnecessarily for an A. I apologize, Mr. Brown Shoes. For getting in where I fit in and waving a four and a one your way, sir. You're finished, white boy. Brown shoes don't give a shit about you. You're finished. You're back. 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 You're finished. you are my landlord liked the fact that he ain't got a head up in here. You know what I'm saying? He liked the fact that his shit is mellow yellow. And he liked the fact that even his buddies all surrounding these buildings tell him, nah, we don't even know Richie Radio exists. Who the fuck is Richie? Oh, the nice white guy who comes to church uh, down here on Sunday right underneath the window? Oh, that guy? No. We don't ever hear his voice through our TVs, our telephones, our, 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 our musical test equipment. No, sir. His only gripe with me, friend, is not a gripe at all. I fell a little behind on the rent because I got a bunch of jealous, barking little pieces of shit mislabeling me. But he knows that I'm going to stand the test of time. And whatever work it is I do on these electronics, he's going to allow me to keep doing it because it makes his establishment look good. <laughs> Well, Mr. Pitbull, you acted like you the blackout cabal, and you said, now I know what you'll look like, now you're finished. You acted like you a boss, a big man. All you did was show me a little pussy puppy on my sidewalk this morning that I had to wait for. So I'll tell you what, whatever the case may be, Mr. Pitbull, I hope it cost you a good amount, because it's not going to turn out your way. But I do know this. Like Najee says, come with me. Whatever may come my way, Mr. Pitbull. It'll never be from a barking little mad, can't win, do it himself, puppy dog. Hey, Pitbull, don't you know you want something done right? You gotta do it yourself? When are you gonna figure that out? You can't even be a half a perpetrating fraud gangster. You don't even know that. I'm just a fucking cop, and even I know that. I got down. You want to do it right. You're going to take your antenna down by yourself. You got that right. You got that right. Hey, yo, man, fuck. 
He, he back on antenna. I, I, I didn't say one word about antenna. I think Pitbull is very mad that his microphone gangsterism is in the basement over here. I think Pitbull is really mad that he can boss people around behind the mic for the last couple of decades. But hey, there's a fucking, there's a, there's a bulldog in town, baby. A Georgetown bulldog with the full weight of the big old man. And you know what? Old man don't like people his skin color acting like you. Especially with his second in command. So Pitbull, stop barking. If Richie make you look like the asshole you are all the time with your own words, barking out your non-beef, I ain't got no beef, I just want to key up and try to be the hero asshole. Hey, Pitbull, I'm going to leave Channel 6 alone because that's what the real men on this channel expect from a major player like me. You know what I'm saying? I know this, Pitbull. I know you'll never be body number 18 for me. I got down. <laughs> Every time you make him look like a tiny little asshole, he laughs like a hyena. Yes, he will never be body number 18. Whatever may happen, I'm glad. Listen to, listen to this cry, baby. Is this a man? Now I know what you look like is you done. Now I know what you look like is you done. Well, everybody out here listening to you sound like an asshole right now. Was expecting you to roll up here and try to be the pit bull you claim to be. Except it didn't go down that way, did it, wussy? Have a good day, Channel 6. I deeply apologize, but y'all got a microphone gangster, a punk, and a pussy, and I wish he would have left so I could have took a few pounds out of him. I'll see ya. This is a tough guy talking about the next man's mother. Some microphone gangster you are. Piss, piss, piss. See you on the next... Oh, sorry, I'll never see you again. That's right, you ain't that kind of man. Yo, you let all your friends down today, but that's the piss chump you are. Can you just tell brown shoes you're gonna stop plugging his ears? Why you keep killing up plugging brown shoes ears? You don't hear me. You don't hear me. He hear you right like, boy. Shut up. Nah, he don't hear me, because I've been running bad for, for the last six transmissions, pussy. <laughs> I'll be anything you want, but I already outsmarted you, because you let all your people down today. You were supposed to come over here and live up to the pit bull repertoire and punch a white boy in the face, do something Uncle Daddy and Cousins can't do. But you know what, pit bull? You ain't no pit bull anywhere, except in your own fucking mind. The bulldog told you that, and I got the whole. I'll never touch you in front of your house. I'll never touch you in front of your house. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I know what you look like now. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> you talking like I should be scared of something. Woo! Why do you keep talking then? Why do you... Do you talk brown shoes? You want to stop plugging his ears? Stop plugging brown shoes ears, cracker. Jeez. Well... I, I would have loved to crack you, but you weren't the leapfrog. You let everybody on six down today because you're a big, fat, big mouth pussy. Hey, Doc! Hey, Doc! Hey, Doc! I just want to see what he looked like. Now I know what he looked like, Doc. Hey, Doc, now I know what he looked like.